Now, a preview of the flying wing transport of tomorrow. The midsection provides ample room for 80 passengers. The spaciousness keynotes the luxurious main lounge, extending 53 feet inside the wing. And future air travelers will really see something. Through the plexiglass windows of the front wing edge, passengers have an unimpaired view of the Earth, unrolling thousands of feet below. Coast-to-coast -coast flights in four hours may not be too far away. Wing controls are like those of a conventional plane except for elevons, combining functions of elevator and aileron. Today, a potent defense weapon, it may revolutionize commercial flying. The dorsal tip of the plane provides an excellent vantage point to see the world go by. Snug as bugs in their magic carpet, air travelers can look down on mere earthlings as the double quartet of mighty turbojets whistle them through space. This flying wing bomber is the 12th type to be designed by John K. Northrop since 1939. The latest addition to a family of planes that may someday rule the air. Surprisingly enough, the luxurious wing is simpler to build than other planes, being a single unit with a structure extending from tip to tip. The sleek Air Leviathan carries more cargo farther, faster, and with less fuel than any comparable plane. And the bar will raise the spirits of those who don't feel high enough in the stratosphere. The flying wing has the stability of a fine club, and refreshments can safely be wheeled in. This new device is an electromagnetic table holder. The public quickly accepts all the miracles that science provides. Even skyliners like this will become commonplace. But the giant flying wing is more than a super streamlined airplane. It is the fulfillment of scientific vision and symbolizes the practical dreams of science for our world of tomorrow.